get the, the macro lens on it there. See, it's dead, see? Where is that, cocksucker? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think I got the son of a bitch. <laughs> so, normal figure, dead figure from the cold. <laughs> Sixty-two, is it? Something like that. Excuse me, sir. Can I have a word with you? Huh? Can I have a word with you? Can I have a word with you? Yeah. Go are ahead. you are you comfortable? No. Why aren't you comfortable? Well, it's too damn cold in here. <laughs> okay. You, you, even animals uh, don't work under these conditions. <laughs> okay. Anything else you'd like to say about the general state of affairs here? Or the any general other state of affairs, if you have to wear mittens to work and wool socks and, and wool underwear, they can take the job and shove it. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Lynn. <laughs> Look at Lynn. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Can I have a few words with you about working conditions in this Make building? Make it short because it's cold in here. Okay. Uh, any any what, any comments at all or? Yeah, yeah. Can't see him on camera though. Oh, okay. I think your telephone's ringing. <laughs> Should we show this to John when he gets here today? Why, sure. All damn right. $1,600 a month rent and, and, and no heat. That's a little bit like horse shit, isn't it? Huh? I say that's a little bit like horse shit. I think we should, we should have an inspection by OSHA. All right. Getting any warmer there, Ray? Or oh, yeah, yeah. Is, is it works pretty good, does it? Yeah. yeah. It's better to heat for the furnace. <laughs> what furnace are you talking about? <laughs> the furnace is done to work. I see.
Pardon me. I said, pardon me. You're getting all, almost like pinch hole. Pinch hole. Well, you can put tape on it next so we can't touch it. I had a brick and a tape and it up. Don't lie. <laughs> I didn't say I turned it down. Well, put it this way. I didn't. I didn't. didn't. <laughs> Maybe one of the clients did. I heard it. Oh, I'm too close. Okay, drink the coffee. Put your feet up on the desk. Eyes <laughs> closed. <laughs> Resume handles. Is it recording or what? It was. Push the button and see what happens. Well, I have to look at your. It's recording. It's not recording now. Sure it is. How can it be? I'm not pushing the button. You don't have to hold it down. You just push it down. It's like a switch. Well, how do I shut it off? Push it again. Are you working now? No, I. Steven. Steven. <laughs> to tell you what it looks like, how it's set up. Basically, all a resume is is an expanded job application. That's all it is, as you'll see when you read this. All that thing is doing is telling you, um, I don't know, how shall I put it? It's telling the employer things that you don't have room for in the job application. And as you can see, the application is pretty big. Sure. Okay, and then the resume, if she would call me for an interview, can I bring the resume then? I'll take it. Telephone call for you. Yeah. Yeah. Convention, Dennis. You are, huh? Want to read the card, Ray, for the camera? Mm -hmm. He said, you want to read the card for the camera? So we know who those nice flowers are from? Season's greetings to Lynn and the gang from Renadish. Well, isn't that nice? Those are nice flowers.
You want me to hold it? Sure, if you could, Ray. Huh? Give it some kind of a personal touch. That's nice. How's that? that? Let me zoom in on those things here. Huh? Let me zoom in on those. Very nice. On the TV? <laughs> Just a minute. Oh, yeah, okay. I get it. <laughs> okay. okay. Wait a minute. Let me, let, me, let me zoom in on that card there, Ray, okay. so, so people can read what the heck is going on here. Can you see that rent a dish on there? Is that? Oh yeah, very fine. Rent a dish. Yeah. Now let's zoom in on the flowers. Yeah. Now zoom in on the guy there. Very Seems to be in fine working order this morning. That is a sharp camera. I don't like that. I'm job service stuff in an office, but uh, I'll go to the main office and help. Well, the electronics equipment goes to a warehouse in Madison. Mm. And uh, there it, uh, it sits until it's outdated. That's a shame. And then when it's obsolete, they give it to, like, uh, workshops mm. and uh, like ODC to take apart and, and find out how things used to work and all this kind of stuff. <laughs> we used to have a woolen sack, a woolen sack tape recorder in this office. It's, in its day, it was probably the top of the line as far as home tape yeah. recorders goes. I mean, it was just yeah, a beautiful machine. Cheap stuff. Yeah. And eventually, we never used, never used it for anything. And eventually, it just went to Madison. And uh, I called down to Madison once, you know, to see how you could bid on stuff like that or whatever. She says, oh, it sits around down here until we, we get to fill the shelves, and then we just give it away to, to organizations to take apart and see how it works. Uh -huh. The damn thing was brand new. I mean, it was, you know, 10, 12 years old, but it was a brand new machine. Oh, God. I mean, you f go figure stuff like that. It's well, nuts. Well, at least her jet card goes into a pool and people, other offices can get it. Yeah, well, you want to hear nutso, you know, like this VCR here. Down in Rapids, they got... A VCR and a camera like this and a tripod for the UC workshop, which they do once a week. They've got a, exactly the same unit for WIA, which I know they never use. It's just, they just but never they use it. Both, both agencies could use each other. No, that would be, that would be signs of intelligence that probably would scare those people if they, you know. Th this <laughs> you do wonder. You do wonder. You just go, but I don't, is the bureaucracy so bad that when somebody comes up and says, hey, let's save some money by sharing? You know, do they, does their job go in jeopardy then? Well, I suppose they go on somebody's kind of a list. Yeah. I imagine. Very
video diary care. Oh, is that what yeah, it's right. for? All right. <laughs> well, thanks for coming. Bye. Bye. We had a good bunch of kids there. Let them know that, okay? Thanks. Okay, we'll bye. See uh, 396. Oh, I didn't show them the computers. I was waiting for you to come out and do that. Dennis, why didn't you say something? Well, I was going to, but... type quite that fast because I'm short of fingers, but <laughs> the rest of it I can handle. Um, do you know, can you tell me something about that? Or do mm, you I, have to, you'll have to wait until Dennis comes back. Oh, right. I'm from the Rapids office. Ah. <laughs> He's just trying to track down these kids. I hope they're not all gone. Are they all gone already? No, oh, good. <laughs> I'm just so embarrassed. <laughs> oh, well. Is that still on? <laughs> I think so, yeah. Oh, my embarrassment here? I forgot one part that, that the other kids thought was okay, real interesting, so I wanted to make sure. <laughs> and and uh, just basically ask about the office manager position. I'm going to be talking to the guys that are hiring for that. <laughs> that's, that's exactly what they're looking for. Uh, like I said, I don't, don't type that fast. I, right. I, I can't. Well, they're looking for managerial stuff rather than typing anyway, I believe. Right now I'm manager of Dell, but okay. that's kind of a thing that's just closer to my kids because my kids are little, but I've, I've managed a real estate office. And, uh, right. So. Okay. Okay, good. We'll see you later. Okay. Dennis? You can use yours, Carol. Can I? Yeah. Now, the, the, the computer screened 418 applicants, and they came up with six that matched what that employer is looking for. I'm not used to this computer. We have a real modern one in our office. It, it works a little different than this one does. This is an antique. Missed something along the yeah. way. Not too bad. If you can get in there, it's all right, but I think you should probably go around the other way. Okay. Well, no, you can go in there, I guess. I think once you get in there, it'll be all right. It's all plowed out.
Not so good. Slippery action. He'll be in this pretty soon. Yeah, he had to get snowed out or shoveled out. It's a spy picture for me. <laughs> Catching me with a cigarette in my hand. Oh, at the front desk, too. <laughs> Very 
very slow day, as I remember. Yes, it was. <laughs> Snowing like crazy. Well, enough of this nonsense. Well, videotape. Videotape. This is Patchy's, our new OJT lady took over for Kay, who's long gone. <laughs> She's very busy already. She's only been here for a couple of hours. Can you imagine? And there's Vic back there, who just loves it when I take videos of him. Studying hard. Yeah. What do I do now? How come it won't go? <laughs> what is it? Well, I got a list of here on that job order. I was just practicing. And there's four. How do I get back to the other one? I push PA1 and I don't get anything. Okay, PA1 you can't use on that. Oh. <laughs> that, yeah. You can do that on the other ones. Okay, you want to go to the next person? Is that it? Yeah. Um, then you do PF1. PF1? Alt PF1. It was the same deal as before, where you push the alt, okay, and then you push the PF1. Uh, PF1 over here. Yeah, yeah, up there. Oh, okay. I don't know if that'll work. You might have gone. Oh, there yeah, it goes. Okay. There it goes. Yeah, okay. I thought you might have gone out of line, but it's all right. Okay. Yeah, that's the one you have to do on that one. You might feel more at home if you use Steve's computer. Well, that one, that's okay. That's all right. This is fine. car.
you got that thing on already? Yeah, go ahead. Hi, I'm Audrey Robus. Happy St. Patrick's Day. I'm here doing work experience. Okay. It is St. Patrick's Day, isn't it? Yes, it's St. Patrick's okay. Day. Let's go see where you work. Pardon? Let's go see where you work. Must I? Yeah. Oh, I thought this was Ray's desk. Well. Good. And you're the receptionist too, right? Yes. Okay. Oh, it's snowing outside. Oh, telephone. Look at a picture of Yance on the phone. Good morning, job service. Oh, no, she's not. Yeah, he's here. Okay, just a minute, please. Who is it? Get snow pictures every year. Like to be in our family video. Is this your family video? It's a family video, right? Pat's on what here. What am I? The mother, the daughter, the um, father, the son? You're our visiting cousin from Frostbite Falls, Minnesota. Oh, yes. Would you like me to talk about it? Sure. <laughs> That's Rocky Bullwinkle's uh, hometown. Did you know that, Rocky the Squirrel? Oh, I think I ran into him on the street there one day. Is that right? Yeah. Was he flying? I don't remember. I think he was driving a car. A car. <laughs> he was a pretty bad driver, though. A roller skate, I'll bet. Yeah, probably drives like you do. <laughs> Aren't you guys going to smoke today so I can tape you? Well, normally we're supposed to take things like mock interviews and this kind of thing. Oh, that's the purpose of it. Great. do you actually tape? We don't do much of anything with it, except our family tape. Oh. <laughs> I have some gold for you, do Yeah, um, I was wondering, do you have any part-time jobs up on the wall? Once you look on the board, there's quite a few things up there, that's all okay. I can tell you. I think basically, uh, are you are you from Loyal? Yeah. Okay, well... Why don't you check it out? Um, let me ask you this: Would you be willing to come into town for for anything, or you want to stick around loyal pretty much? I suppose. No, I plan on driving. Oh, okay. Well, if you see anything up there that's interesting, just let me know. I'll give you a referral. Okay. but he quit. <laughs> <laughs> I know, he works for my sister now. Oh, is that right? Yeah. I'll be he, darned. That's how I know him. Oh, okay. He's okay. a funny guy. Vic sits back there. I don't know if he'll be in the day or not. Was Al real serious when he first started? Yeah. That's the way he always is. The, did he lighten up? And yeah. Start telling jokes and <laughs> yeah. stuff? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, see you later. Goodbye. I said, well, you know, 
know, since we haven't done anything, I said, they may want you to come down Monday and Tuesday. And he said, well, I'm going to have a problem with that because my wife is going to have the car and we only got one car. see no problem. See, Monday and Tuesday are busy days for my wife. You know, she's in school until 9 o'clock at night from 7 in the morning. So that's the reason why. And uh, she doesn't come home for supper, so... Oh, 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 what was... <laughs> Just as the computer's having problems, but we knew that already. Yeah. This is our new Vets fella. He's going to be sitting in where Steve used to sit. Temporarily. Temporarily. Yes. And what's your name, sir? Len. Len. Yeah, Len Moore. Len Moore. Yeah. Just temporarily. Temporarily. Working the clinic, though. Well, pretty soon you'll be as crazy as we are, Lynn. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. See, yeah. I, worked, I worked this kind of job before. Oh, okay. And I went crazy and I got out of oh, okay. it. Okay, okay, I get it. So maybe you got to talk to the agent. <laughs> Monday or Wednesday?